Rosenstein exposes deep state ties with latest outrageous statement by Amy Moreno for TruthFeedNews.com. Deep, deep state ties. Deputy Attorney General Rod Rosenstein has shown his true deep state colors with his latest outrageous statement regarding Robert Mueller's bogus Trump Russia collusion uh, probe. The acting AG, who was forced to step in and take control after Jeff Sessions recused himself, is now defending Mueller and saying there is no justification to end the Trump-Russia election interference probe. This outrageous statement comes after over a year of investigation, which has uncovered zero evidence that Trump and Russia colluded and also after the House Intel Committee ended their investigation, firmly stating no collusion. What doesn't he understand? But he knows he's going down. Uh, from the Hill, Deputy Attorney General Rod Rosenstein defended Special Counsel Robert Mueller in an interview published Monday saying that he doesn't believe there is any justification for ending the probe into Russia's election interference. Is he going to foot the bill? Uh, th that's what I'd like to ask. The special counsel is not an unguided missile. Rosenstein told USA Today, I don't believe there is any justification at this point for terminating the special counsel. What are they investigating? The Washington Post reported earlier this year that President Trump had ordered that Mueller be fired last summer, but was thwarted by White House counsel Don McGahn, who threatened to resign over the move. Trump has repeatedly attacked Mueller's probe as a witch hunt. Rosenstein, who appointed Mueller following the firing of FBI Director James Comey and recusal of Attorney General Jeff Sessions from the 2016 investiga uh, investigation, said, oversight of the probe takes up only a fraction of his time on a daily basis. He also defended the Justice Department from recent attacks. Trump and Republican lawmakers have slammed the department and the FBI, claiming officials there are biased against Trump. I believe much of the criticism will fall by the wayside when people reflect on this era and the Department of Justice, said Rosenstein, who did not mention Trump by name during the interview. I'm very confident that when the history of this era is written, it will reflect that the department was operated with integrity. Oh, that ship has sailed, uh, Rosenstein. Uh, he also said that he felt very confident in his ability to carry out his job. In any particular job, you recognize that your time is going to be limited. My goal is to get as much done for as long as I'm here in the job, Rosenstein said. And when my time is up, whenever that may be, I'm confident that I'm going to be able to look back proudly on the work our department has done while I've been fortunate enough to be here, he continued. Rosenstein added that he had anticipated that this would be a lower profile job, but that he wouldn't uh, trade places with past deputy attorneys, uh, attorney generals. Uh, his comments came the same day GOP lawmakers on the House Intel, uh, Intelligence Committee announced that they were ending the panel's probe into Russia's election interference. The Republican lawmakers are finalizing their report on the probe's findings and will say that they found no evidence of collusion between the Trump campaign and Russia. I mean, uh, you know, I mean, this is just absurd. Who's going to foot the bill, Rosenstein? And you know you're going to be uh, uh, implicated if uh, the Mueller probe is uh, put to rest, right? Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And again, thank you so much for watching.